Alright, so welcome viewers to uh, Team Gated. We are back here with another video of uh, Diablo 3. And we're doing it all. Alright? We're not just playing one game. Okay? We're, we're playing it all. And so here's a look at my, um... I think, uh... I think I may start a new, um... A new team in the in the in the most current season. This is uh, last year's um, season. Uh, the reason why I haven't uh, I, I I've, I've been continuing to play with this group is because I I want to get a feel for um, um, how is this group gonna do in the in the harder aspects of the game. You know, I did run with a, a set of uh, witch doctors. Which was pretty safe and uh, conservative. Like you know, they didn't really push too much damage, and I really didn't want to, you know, take the chance of dying. Uh, so I made them kind of like um, like tanks almost, you know, and kind of like um, and and in a weird build, like a confusion build, and just kind of just turned all of the enemies against themselves and had them kill each other. Um, but like this particular this particular team is strictly offensive. Um, and I could really pick stuff off from like from like the bottom of the screen, and and, and I'll show you guys a little bit of um of, of how of how exciting this group could be. Um, right now, I am currently doing um was I doing master? That's crazy. Um, I guess I was doing master. All right, we'll we'll see. Um, what does master give me anyway? Master, wait. Boundaries. Um, what does the master give you? Oh, okay. Um, Imperials, gems can drop. What's this? Um, new legendary items become available at 70. Oh, torment. Um, well, <laughs> we're gonna do master because again, the the other thing is that I really I, I don't really have um great gear on all of them, and I'm really really not familiar with all of the the in-game stuff as far as gems and all the uh, uh, rating systems and all that good stuff so I've been just trying to get a feel of you know just little by little and trying to gear little by little so I could finally get the complete gear of something and then uh, move forward into the difficulty of the game so um, here we go here we go here we go all right so, and this is a public game too, so anybody could actually really join. Um, but again, just really just trying to perfect my hunters. I, dude, I, I love this group, and, and they're exciting, and um, do a lot of damage. And my pets keep a lot of things busy, you know. So, okay, so my paragon level is 122 on one guy, uh, like 80, 91 on one, and 89 on the other. Okay, so here we go, and um, gotta get my guys together. And I'm gonna okay. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna go to the waypoint here, and basically what we wanna do here is go to. I like to, I like to um, uh, farm in um, Act One. So who's this skeleton? Can we? Ugh. Um. Oh. We're gonna start with this first just to see how, how difficult these guys are and then we'll move along. Uh, the bosses are kind of tricky. But, uh, let me just show you guys a little bit of like, a little bit of um that's where gonna blow this just a little. Yeah, I, I don't wanna blow your eardrums out, so we'll lower this. Um sometimes I keep it relatively high because I I, I want to be able to hear if there's any legendaries that fall on the other windows you know so um, oh shit um, so what are you doing? enter the watchtower? what are you uh, okay so this way no you don't get to lurk any people I could tell right off the back this is I was playing expert so this is master this is a little more
a little more difficult. As you guys know, this is hardcore. Hardcore! Basically, um, when you die, you lose everything. Okay, so let me just tell you real quick how my, my build is. It's, it's kind of a... Why is one... It should be all running the same speed, but okay. Oh. So basically, um, you see these little red traps here? And basically they are my spike traps. So simultaneously um, lay multiple deadly traps that explode on contact when armed. So that's what I do with that. Um, when it gets really, really crazy, I put down my my sentries um, and I have it on the polo station so I basically want to slow everything down in the game um, and then have my turrets pick them off my pets pick them off and then me shooting um, I also use um, freezing strike um, bolas so um, I could um, I could freeze them and then um, you know and slow things down so that's pretty much my build I don't know if it's a build that's really, really going to do well in the higher risk, but um, multi-boxing with the hunters is a little different. Um, if I find a better strat, I may use one. I just like the idea of slowing things down in hardcore. I, I think it's the best thing to do. So one of my guys just actually decided to run. I don't know why, but he did. And so now i got to get him back together. That's the only weird thing about this build is that, well, multi-boxing, you have to... Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong oh, that's why. That's why. Okay, there we go. I got the right button now. Um... There we go. I got some gold here. Oh, you crap. Okay, so I close everything down here, which is pretty nice. I don't see any legendaries on the others. Um, this, yeah, this, this is actually, well, this is Master. Okay, so, so far, so good. Um, again, my guys aren't really, really tweaked, tweaked for, um, um, Torment. But I'm once, I'm one step away from Torment, which is pretty nice. And then I could really start to, start to find, uh, really good stuff. Um, we just gotta... An opponent. An ally has joined the party, but my foe is in strength. We're gonna get some uh, some help here. Got oh, a little lag there. There's another hunter. <laughs> Any legendaries? Nope. We got four hunters in this game. Wow.
no fui yo. Legendaries, no, nope. don't see any. Alright, let's see here, let's see what we get here. into that bounty. Alright, alright, alright. Let's see where we're gonna head next. So this is actually a little more difficult because it uh, we um we are um Field Misery. We are playing with another person in the game so it makes it a little harder. More challenging, which is nice. Deal with that. Legendary here for one of my dudes, which is pretty dope. Gotcha. Okay. Because okay. I gotta, gotta ch watch all the screens here. This is the difficult part. And then sometimes when you play with um, other people, they tend to run up ahead of you and kill everything, and then you don't get any experience. Right. We're almost closing in on this bounty, which is dope. Um, Cemetery of the Forsaken. Okay, what we got here? Oh, wrong way.
Ah. Town. Almost got it. And I normally tell people what I use, what programs. I can't do that. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay. And there we go. Last one is courtyard. Probably gonna have to get some uh, speed enhancements like this guy here. This guy's really fast. Hey! Sometimes fast is not good. Up. Oh. Go nope, back up. Because in fast, uh, the fast you are uh, when you when your tunes do get separated, which they happens, um, it's harder to get them back together because they're so fast and they're. They're out of control. Yeah, so. Well, we're gonna take a little while here to catch up to this guy. And in the meanwhile, he's probably gonna kill every living, living thing walking through. So let's see what we can do. We can catch up. Gotta catch up, 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 gotta catch up. Gotta catch up. Gotta catch up. Gotta catch up. Gotta catch up.
Link, link. Bam. Yeah, looks like we completed everything. Oh no, the Skeleton King, right? Oh yeah. Skeleton King is the last one. Let's do this, boys. Probably missed some experience up there too. Cool. Anything here? Nope. Thanks for waiting. By the way. There we go. So now we get the boss, which is pretty dope. Oh, we go straight in. Dope. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to favorite, like, share, and subscribe if you want to see more. Peace.